The reason the files look differently when you export them from MemoQ, even if you choose to export them as uh, Trados, is that uh, each CAT tool has its own segmentation rules. So in order to import Trados file in MemoQ, you need to follow Trados segmentation rules and not MemoQ. For achieving this, what you need to do is to first pre-segment the file. And you do this not in MemoQ, but in Workbench. And what you do is having a simple pre-translation, which is uh, most of the time a fake translation. But the reason for doing this is for having the right segments that MemoQ will consider if they are already segmented. So you go to Tools, then Translate, and then you import the file that you need to translate in MemoQ but deliver a Stratos format. You click Add and get to the file that you want to translate. Then, and this is a very important setting, you be absolutely sure that you have segment unknown sentences checked and update document, not update TM. And then you just click translate. You click close. So in MemoQ, you will import the segmented file. As usual, uh, Workbench created a BAK, a backup copy, but we are not interested in that, so don't take the backup file, but the actual file. And you import it. What you will have when you open the file with either double click or right click and open the translation will be a file with all sources equal the target because uh, it makes a copy of source to target and you can either of course delete uh, as you translate but you can do this in one move in MemoQ with operation and clear translation and you have options here white translation to uh, clean and you clean all translation. You have warning, of course. After this preparation, you start translating as usual by using your uh, translation memory in which you can import TMS files if the client provides one. And don't forget you can always check uh, the preview of the final file. You confirm each segment with uh, Control enter and MemoQ will automatically jump to the next unconfirmed segment if you don't change the setting. After your file is translated and all the segments are confirmed, you export as dialog if you want the clean file, but if you want the unclean file, you export as bilingual and you choose Trados compatible. Then just click export. You can choose the name and the location, of course. And here we have our bilingual file in Trados with the right formatting that you can uh, later use as any other Trados file.